All right, guys, let's look at dividing whole numbers by unit fractions. Remember, when you start with a whole, you end with a whole. Okay, now looking at this first problem, here it says, I have three Twizzlers to share with five friends. If I give each friend one third of the Twizzler, will there be enough? Okay, so we know we have three. That's how many Twizzlers we have. We have five, five friends that we're sharing with, right? And then each friend gets one third. Each we know tells us either to multiply or divide. All right, so let's talk about what we have here. In this problem, we have some Twizzlers, right? We have one Twizzler, two Twizzlers, three Twizzlers. Okay, now, <clears throat> it says she's going to give each friend one-third of a Twizzler. Well, we don't, we know we're going to give them one-third, but we don't know how much one-third is because we haven't split them. So if we go ahead and split them, this can be for one friend, right? We can split this one. It's another friend here. And we can split this one here. Oh, look, there's another friend. But this can also be a friend, and this is 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 a friend. She has three pieces here, three pieces here, three pieces here. So she has a total of nine pieces all together. The question is, is will there be enough for five friends? There's nine pieces, so yes, there will be enough. We took originally, let's look at our equation. We had three Twizzlers. We divided them by thirds, and we ended up with nine pieces. We know that if we start with a whole, we must end with a whole. All right, so that is looking at it as a pictorial model. Now, if we look at it as a number line, this one, different problem, Karen has four cookies and she wants to give each friend one half of a cookie. How many pieces will she have to share? Okay, so she has four cookies. She wants to give each friend half, right? So, looking at this on a number line, We know she has four cookies, so we're going to go from zero to four. So one, two, and three. Now, this is going to equal one whole cookie. So here it says she has, each friend is getting a half of a cookie. So I know that this is going to have to be split into halves, right? This right here equals cookie enough for one friend. This right here is enough cookie for another friend. If you split this one into half, here's another friend, another friend. Split this one into halves. One friend. Oh, another friend. Split this one into half. Here's one friend. Sorry. One friend and another friend. So all in all, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight total friends. Now, for if you notice, for right here for one whole cookie, she was able to get two pieces. So you could have just counted by twos. Here's another two pieces, another two pieces, and another two pieces. So two, four, six, eight, she was able to get eight pieces. Essentially, we started off with four cookies. We divided each of them into half. That left us with eight total pieces. Same amount of cookies, they're just into smaller pieces.
Remember, we started with a hole, so we have to end with a hole.